These are analog thermometers designed to uh, measure the temperature of things. This particular meat, you can see, this one talks about the meat, and it's, it's really good, but it's very slow. Uh, this one's a lot faster. Now, this is the Thermal Pro, and you can see the ambient temperature uh, of the probe is 82 degrees Fahrenheit. Uh, whoop. Here is the probe, and I'll stick the probe in the oatmeal, and you can watch it climb. Now it's already climbed up to 158. Does that match? Uh, that's pretty close to this thermometer, and this thermometer is just getting there. Now, this is a infrared digital thermometer that uses a infrared beam of light, which I'll show you. Okay, now you can see that beam of light out there. It's measuring the surface of the cooktop, and that's 78, so that pretty much matches what the other thermometer said. But <coughs> what about this? This says the oatmeal is 129. And the, the other probe said 158. This one said 158. That's kind of wacko. So let's take a cup of coffee, which is something that we all enjoy. And we will measure it. Let's see here. It says 164. Well, let's see how quickly this one works. 167, 169. So there's a discrepancy here. And what's the analog say? That one says 163. This one's harder to read because I'm older and I'm magnifying it, so it's getting up there slowly, but the, let me see, yep. So we're not really sure what the temperature is. So if you're, uh, if you're an engineer or a calculating cook, uh, it might be good to have all of these devices to, just to get an average or see what's consistent. And here we have a air fryer that has a probe attached and we have the on off button and we have the probe button. So now the probe, oh, where is it? The probe is telling me that the surface temperature of this countertop is 76. So now I'm gonna hit it with the uh, infrared and it says 78. So now we'll see how this does, how accurate it is. We'll put it in the just poured coffee and it's reading 128, 131, 132, 33, four. So you can see it's it takes a little time for it to climb. Looks like it's stabled at 130, oh, there's 138. So you can see even the, the Thermal Pro, not Thermal Pro, but the, uh, the probe, it is a thermal probe, but this is all going up almost to 140. So let's try our handy dandy Uh, and it said 137. So they're fairly close. Fairly close. Whoop. So there you have it. And you see it's just slowly moving back down.